What's up, family? Welcome to A3 Crypto. If you're new to the channel, thank you for tuning in. I appreciate you all for being here with me today. In this video, we're going to talk about Vito. We're going to look at Vito on the chart. As you can see, she's looking kind of bullish right now. Even though she really didn't go up that far yesterday. I was hoping she would go up a little bit farther, but she didn't. It's cool. Hopefully she'll get up out of here. Let's go to the daily chart. I just want to see how far we got to. Yeah, we've been in this little range. So let me see here. Let me see. Horizontal line. I want to get like, there we go. Let me get it red. Let me get a fat one though. Hold on, let me see. Excuse me. Um, I want to draw the. I want to draw the range. The range we've kind of been in this whole time. Hold on. Turn this up a little bit. This one will move up to about here. It's like 0 0.028, 0 0.028. So uh, we've been in this range for like almost for about 60 some days. Let's see, what's, what's the date over here? Let's say uh, 321, March 21st. And today is uh, May 3rd. So it's been about two months, a little bit over two months. We're going sideways here. I think that, I mean, it looked like, I don't know, man. It's hard to say. But you would think that it'd go up. I don't understand why it's not going up. I know the volume being low. The volume's gonna be kind of low. Let's go see what the volume is real quick on Vito. It seems like Vito volume is low. We're back at 137. Market cap rank. 24 hour trading volume. It's pretty high, kind of. It was 60, 60 million like a couple days ago. Now it's 87. So that's pretty good. We're close to 100 million. That's pretty good. I don't know, man. I'm just I'm ready for Vito to take off, man. I don't know what's I don't know what's taking so long here. But she's not looking good as far as the numbers go. Over the past 30 days, we only up like 13%, man. I mean, 11 percent, 11.3 percent. I'm just saying, like, that's not good. We only 60 percent from the all time high. Like, we would have been there, man. Minus all this FUD, I think we would have been there by now. I don't know what's going on here. Go three cent right there. Go three cent right there. <laughs> three cent. Come on, man. We can't get the three cent. All this sideways should be straight up. We should be at like eight, nine cent right now. For some reason, we, we stuck under under 35 sats. It's 40 up here. 40 sats. That's the high right there. Over the past thir uh, 60 some days, the high is, uh, what is it? 0.02514. Point zero two five one four. That's the high. So I don't, I don't know, y'all. I think she's gonna be. I don't think she's gonna fall. I think we're gonna just go sideways until she decide to go up. I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's just people not buying right now. The market, the market kind of stagnant though. 
Cause Vet went up some also, but Vet didn't really stay up that far, that long. Vet didn't stay up that long. So uh, right now we negative point six, negative three point seven against Bitcoin. Market cap six hundred and forty-seven thousand. I mean million, six hundred and forty-seven million four hundred and fifty-eight thousand. No man, look like Vitor. Let's go to let's go back to the chart. Cause it looked like Vitor is uh in a bullish state. I mean you should look kind of I mean, minus this side over here. This don't look bullish. This little area right here look kind of bullish. This look this look a little bullish. But we'll see. We'll see what she does. We're on the hourly right now, and she's kind of, let's see, she's dumping right now. We're under the moving average. So right now, we just, we just, uh, man. I don't know, man. We're going to be all right, though. I think it's going to go up eventually. Like I said, we got support. I don't think it's going to fall. We got support. We just we just stuck in a sideways movement. That's all. But we got support, so I don't think she's gonna fall down. I think she just we just gotta wait and see what Vet do. See what new. Uh, we gotta see what uh, what V Chain got going on. Hopefully, V Chain make a move. A nice business move, announcement, some kind of announcement. Maybe Elon Musk might say something. Elon might tweet vet. You never know what happens. What happened? That'd be crazy. <laughs> if, he, if he tweet vet or veto, you already know what's gonna happen. It's gonna shoot up. Almost hit a cuss word. It's gonna shoot up. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna see what happens. That's all I got in this video. It's gonna be a quick one. There ain't really much, too much to talk about with Vitor. Let's go over here to uh, Vitor Foundation really quick. See if anything over here. Oh, so they, they listed it. Crypto.com exchange list Vito. Trey Vito and pair and uh, USDT pair now. So US, so they got Vito and the USDT pair. That's a move right there. Okay. Okay. I see you. I see you. Why well, the price ain't moving? Can we get a commercial or something? <laughs> Elon, where you at? Like, come on, man. They ain't always on. I know we listed it. I ain't know crypto.com listed Vito. I didn't know that. That's interesting right there. That was the 29th and the, 20th, the 30th, about three or four days ago. Maybe that's why Vet and Vito had a little run up. Because Vito about 20 million more than it was before they made that announcement. What's this? AMA. Okay, that's old. Yeah, I think that's the reason why it ran up a little bit, maybe. Because they got a listing on crypto.com. Vito did. Somebody told me Vito was already on there. I guess they didn't know what they were talking about. They must have been vet. Vet is, but I don't think Vito was. I'm not sure, because I'm not on crypto.com, so I don't know. But yeah, that's a good move right there. I see you. So, uh, shout out to crypto.com for listening to Vito. It's about time. Let's see what the comments say. See, look, they already they already thinking about. I feel that though. We want to stake it, but it's cool. Just don't don't stake it and then just sell your veto. Though. If you gonna stake it, keep the veto. You feel me? Keep the veto.
Oh, you can go trust wallet. See, people are so worried about Vito. They don't want to keep it though. They just want to sell it. They want to. They want to get the free Vito and then sell it for vet. I think that's counterproductive to the ecosystem, but maybe I'm wrong. But to me, it seemed counterproductive. Why not just keep both? But I don't know. That's just what I think. Just keep both. You ain't gotta sell it. Every time they sell the Vito, the price go down, and that's keeping the, the vet price from going up. You keep selling Vito. Keep selling Vito, man. You're gonna keep the whole ecosystem down, I think. But I could be wrong. If it's more in circulation, ah, they selling it back to the market. So it'll stay in circulation. I don't know. Maybe if they go back to circulation, then people can buy it and it help the price go back up again, maybe. I don't know. I think if people just hold it, man. If we just hold it, I think it'd be better off. So uh, that's about it, y'all. Everybody want to get free veto. Look at this. Uh, if we hold vet in the app to do, to do, if we hold a vet in the app, do we generate veto as we are supposed to? No, you do not. Withdrawal fee is 100 vet. No, it's not. It ain't 100 no more. See, people don't be, they don't know what they're talking about, bro. All right, let's get up off of here, man. I don't want to, I don't want y'all to be looking at this, looking at bad information. But, uh, <laughs> all right, yeah, let's get up off of there. But I appreciate y'all for watching the video. Let's see where Vito is right now. Negative 0.6. We've been around this area. We've been in this range for so long. This is it's just crazy. I don't get it. But uh, shout out to everybody that watched the video to the end. I appreciate you. And I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.